World Restoration Service for World Peace by Jesus Christ. Revelation chapter 3, Revelation chapter and three. Eight, it says, And to the angel of the church in Philadelphia, write these things says, He who is holy, he who is true, he who has the key of David, he who opens and no one shuts, and shuts and no one opens. I know your works. See, I have set before you an open door, and no one can shut it. For you have a little strength, have kept my word, and have not denied my name. God set before you an open door. Now we have to look what kind of door is which God opened for us which God set before us for us to come in and for us to walk through the first door which you have to see this is the door to eternal life. God opened this door for you. The door to your blessings. When this God opened the blessings for you, no matter what darkness wants to close this blessing, darkness will not close. Watch the door to your healings. We have heard many testimonies of many people who went to different places searching for their healings. But we have seen Jesus Christ restoring their health, the door to your success. You were searching your success like a blind man searching in the wrong places. Searching when you are failing to see but today in the name of Jesus the door of your success is open for you. It's your time to walk through this door. You who are not yet saved, not yet born again I'm calling you now to stand up freely and you open your eyes. You take a walk when you will be taking this decision of receiving Christ as your Lord and your Savior. You take a walk and come to the front.
emisamma tsogalona and receive this prayer me la mogele thapelo e by following me say lord jesus christ lord jesus christ today today i'm receiving you i'm receiving you as my lord as my lord and my savior and my savior come into my heart come into my heart and give me new life and give me new life forgive me all my sins forgive me all my sins i confess with my mouth I confess with that my mouth you are the savior that you are the savior and you are the son of god and you are the son of god and you died on the cross for me and you died on the cross for me thank you jesus christ thank you jesus for christ. changing my life for changing my life thank you jesus thank you jesus amen amen open your eyes bulama tswalona praise the lord amen you are born again now you are saved le tsotse se sha ya no le pulusitswe something great so se se go se se tona wonderful se se ntle as it happened se dira gets now in your life ya no mo botsholo ba gago you are redeemed you are washed by the blood of jesus and now you have received eternal life me la mo getse botsholo bo sa khutleng the door of eternal life mo nyako wa botsholo bo sa fele for you and you have entered through it no tsene ka ona mo nyako now you have eternal life me ya no ona le botsholo bo sa khutleng for pastor mongoni to come and give you counseling and welcoming you they are born again they are saved we say shame to the devil shame satan o tlabilwe ke ditlhong hallelujah amen clap hands for them children of god clap hands for them hallelujah amen when i look at you ga ke le lebella i see heaven ululating When I look at you I see God being so pleased You have pleased God by accepting his son Jesus Christ as your savior and your Hallelujah but you need to keep yourself clean you need to ensure that the cleanness the white garment that you have right now becomes clean all the time how are you going to do that number 1 you need to read the bible every day before you read you have to pray to god and say god you know i've just received you i don't even know how to pray to you let your holy spirit do everything for me things that you used to do the life that you were living as from today you are not going to live that life if before you used to go to izangoma no pele no ya go di sangoma inyanga as from today believe in the word of Jesus Christ. you are in the hands of Jesus Christ. let God take over and he will show you one now for you to strengthen yourself in the lord look for the church the church that believes in the bible the church that believes in a prayer nothing else but the prayer world restoration service for world peace by jesus christ